talented young man from Cheyenne. Loudon Hogg making his Crusaders debut tonight. He won a Minnesota high school state title with the Dino a few years back. Now a two on one the other way. McLaughlin, the sauce to Blake, saved by Hogg. Opportunity. Blake's trying to catch this and go to the back end, but a good job by Hogg. A winger last night, played quite a bit of center a season ago. That's why he's in that spot this evening. Loose puck, Albrecht sends it goalward. Hogg with the initial save, unable to swallow up the rebound in the ends. Really good last year as well. Just does a good job getting open. It follows it up, looking for a rebound. And the goaltender was able to cover that up. Loose puck now. Jackson Blake shot through traffic. Good save by Hogg. Good moves. Look at the patience there. Does a good job. And then skates to the open ice. Finish the job and put themselves out of sight on their way towards a weekend sweep. And Owen McLaughlin, the Flyers draft pick, spinning away. McLaughlin backhander. Hogg able to stick out the catching glove and make the grab. Couldn't connect with James on the pass. Bouncing puck back to Frisch. Quickly to Clevin. Tyler Clevin, the toe drag. His shot is saved in the ends. Hogg, though, able to deny North Dakota in this attack so far. The shot of it. Ricketts was right in front of him. North Dakota keeps it in the zone, though. McLaughlin here. Shot blocked on the way. A lot of traffic there. Hogg, though, able to cover. Usually that's what ends up in the back of your net. So the goaltender bails him out there as that puck was. I had Chris written down as the primary assist there and had to quickly cross that out on my score sheet. Clevin shot swallowed up by Hogg. Just great stuff there by Jandrick to push the pace. Oh, baby. Jamernick finding Hayne. Hogg able to slide that right pad over to make the save. A 2016 national title game rematch and likely two teams ranked in the top six in the nation. Ports now finding Costantini, his shot saved by Hogg and held on to in the end. In the fourth line tonight when you got Costantini, Goons and Ports there. Elbrecht on the line as the extra skater as well here tonight. Blake beating James from a tight angle. Hogg tight to that near post for basically the rest of the way. Helston though, one of the top young netminders in the country. An NCHC all-rookie pick as that shot comes in from Jandrick. Carried aside by Hogg. Passing, but these last two shifts have been pretty good, so I'm hoping that they can continue that momentum into these final minutes of the period. Fields with Gaber driving with him. John Caulfield, strong take to the net. Here's Reese Gaber now. Can they get one more here in the first? Loudon Hogg standing strong on that. Over to Costantini. Two sophomores combining. Boots of Vancouver draft pick. Costantini picked by the Sabres a couple of years ago. Carson Albrecht. Hogg will play it off the end boards. Or just how they got there after the faceoff. Here's Schmaltz now whipping one in front, deflected and just wide. Matt Shasky. Here comes North Dakota down at the other ends. And UND got off to such a strong start last night. They nearly get off to an equally impressive opening here. Mark Senden in his first game 24 hours ago. Loose puck in front. Matt Shasky that time to the rescue. Warboard. Reese Gaber, who got on the score sheet on the power play last night, putting one in front for Judd Caulfield. That was certainly the case. And you had guys who did not see much ice time throughout the year step up. Here is Schmaltz whipping one in front. Hog the initial stop. Oh, Caulfield nearly touched that back to the end boards. Gavin Hain now with the power play set to expire. He scored a great goal last night. The third of the night for UND. He'll fire from the top of the slots, and it's going to go just wide. Hog happy to cover.